Hello Libros! This is your reading for the 7th through the 8th of March. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome to the channel. Please hit the like button to the video and subscribe. If you guys are interested in a personal reading, please check out the website first at pinkarianjim.com. <clears throat> if you're unable to access that website, you guys are more than welcome to um, email me at all for one dot one for all seven four at gmail. All right, guys, let's see what's going on for Libras. Hmm, we have the Empress here. I feel like a lot of you guys are starting over, feeling very confident. Um, I think mostly right now you're focused on family. I think you're very alluring. I think that you uh, take care of your shit, to be honest with you. Um, I'm getting that somebody actually looks at you like you guys are um, everything. Like every woman or every man. Like you embody it all. Okay. We have the Two of Cups there. Definitely. Um, there is a connection here with someone, a soul connection. I feel mutual feelings are shared here, Cancer Energy. And the Nine of Pentacles there. Hmm. There's somebody I feel that's been um, single for a while that is, is now interested in a relationship here. Okay, somebody that wants to start over, somebody that wants to um, to be in a relationship here. Okay, so let's see what cards we have coupling these cards. Let's see for the Empress, Two of Pentacles. Somebody's balancing something here, being unsure. I'm I'm thinking this is somebody that's unsure about. Things that have happened in the past, how to start over, how to start anew. Um, but somebody definitely wants to grow with someone in a relationship here and really are unsure about how to do it. Let's see what's with the Two of Cups. Hmm. Somebody has um, become enlightened. There's something that someone has realized here, some truth. Um, somebody has mental clarity about a situation between them and you or you and them however this goes energy can be vice versa here but definitely I feel because there's a choice here we have two twos there's a choice here about how much time to devote to this should you devote time to this um, is this the real thing? Definitely knowing how you feel or how they feel, but not sure about how to act in this situation here. Three of Pentacles. Hmm. Threes are all about growth. Okay, um, I, I'm getting that somebody is definitely wanting to join together in a union, but not really sure about how to do it. Just know how they feel is what I'm getting here. Knowing there has to be compromise in a situation. If you want to be single, then you're single. But if you want to be with someone, you're going to have to compromise in a situation. And this is whether it's you or another individual here okay so let's go ahead and see who's coming towards you guys who's coming towards Libra who's coming towards Libra these of Pentacles I feel strongly an earth sign is here that is wanting to offer something um Capricorn energy here maybe Taurus or Virgo okay Four of Cups, somebody I feel like 
um, is acting like they don't want anything possibly, that they're good by themselves here, but they really, you know, low key want to reconnect with you. Um, they don't want to be single. They do have these strong feelings for you. Um, they're not sure, I feel, about just how to go about having this, this new start, having this growth with you, having this abundance with you, compromising with you. To say, hey, you know, I have these strong feelings for you. I'm willing to compromise here. I'm willing to work with you. Okay. Let's see why this situation is happening over here. Why they are acting like, you know, they're good. When I know they're not, I can see that they're not. This person struggling here. They, they also feel left out in the cold. <coughs> Excuse me. Seven of Wands right there. And the Queen of Swords. Hmm. What I'm getting here is that this person, it's almost like they're acting this way because they are afraid that you're going to cut them off. So before it even gets started good, they're acting like um, they could give or take you when I can see very clearly that they have very strong feelings for you and how they view you as the empress here. But they're, they're really trying to shield themselves here with the Seven of Wands energy, Leo energy, um, from you lashing out at them or cutting them off or leaving them out in the cold because that's the sense that I'm getting here is that they feel like you guys are going to um you know you like you're waiting to bite their head off or something like you're waiting to reject them is what I'm getting from this okay so we have um Leo here we have Cancer Virgo Capricorn um could be another Libra like yourself. I see Taurus is here as well. Maybe Aries energy. All right, guys. So that is what I have for you. And um, I'll be speaking with you soon.